Hey guys, welcome back to Kali J's Kitchen. In today's video, I'll take you guys in the kitchen with me and I'll show you how to make the most amazing drink for men on Valentine's Day. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Make sure you turn on your post notification bell so you guys can always be notified whenever I upload a new video. Tell your friends, tell your family members about Kali J's Kitchen and have them subscribe to my channel. Follow me on Instagram, it's Kali Kitchen underscore one. And also on Facebook, it's Kali J's Kitchen. So this is my custard apple and I'm using half a custard apple and a little piece that was left. So I went ahead, just break the half into two halves again. And I always like to remove the skin from my custard apple, all right? I know some persons like to go in and blend, but for me, I don't like to blend my custard apple. I like to do it the old fashioned way. I like to use my hand to rub it until I get all of that juice out and it tastes so, so good. And it's even better than blending. <laughs> I mean, if you don't like to blend, then that is okay. All right. Again, you always want to take your time to remove the skin from the custard apple because you don't want to break that up. All right. And once you remove the skin, you can always go in and just pull your custard apple apart. And as it says, custard apple, it's a little bit thick, all right? So if you don't like the feeling on your hand, I suggest that you go ahead and blend. So I'm going to go in and add some water. And I'm using room temperature water. And I'm going to combine both the custard apple and the water together. Listen, guys. You have to make sure that when you're doing this, you constantly add water because it tends to get a little bit too thick, all right? As you can see, it's starting to get thick already. So it's a possibility I might have to go in and add some more of the water. And look at that. See? Very thick. And you want to just rub the, all of that together. And you get all of that nice juice. And once you're finished and you get all of that juice from your custard apple, you just go in and you can strain it. Alright, just to remove the seed or the, or the pulp from the custard apple. Just strain it and it's very easy and simple to do. So I'm going to strain it off camera once I get all of that juice. Again, if it's too thick, remember you can always go in and add some more water like I'm doing here. And continue to just combine all of that together. So this is what the juice from my custard apple looks like. As you can see, it's a little bit too thick still, but we're going to make it work. We are going to go in now and add some other ingredients to it. And I'm going to add just a small amount of cinnamon powder just to uplift the taste and also some of the vanilla flavoring. With the with the um, cinnamon powder, guys, you always want to combine both the custard apple juice and the um, cinnamon together because it tends to leave some lumps. If you don't like the lumps, then you can always go in and just use a strainer to strain the juice again. And then I'm going to go in and add my supergen. And I'm using the vanilla flavoring. So once this is all mixed, I'm going to come back and show you guys the final product. Remember, if it's not sweet enough, you can always go in and add a little bit of um, the condensed milk. Or you can use some almond milk. But I will not be using any of those milk in this video. Alright? And there you have it, guys, the perfect drink for men on Valentine's Day. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Make sure you turn on your post notification bell so you guys can always be notified whenever I upload a new video. Go ahead and tell your friends, tell your family members about Kali J's Kitchen and have them subscribe to my channel. Thank you guys so much for watching and see you tomorrow for another awesome recipe. Bye.